Red Rock Canyon. This place has kind of been home for the last two and a half years. We moved here in 2019 in January and it was a normal year. Definitely a lot less busy than it has been in Vegas. And then the pandemic happened and everything was shut down except for this. And we have not a lot of family or friends here and this just kind of became our best friend, this place. Something I love about the desert is how peaceful it is. It's so inviting, or at least it's inviting for me and Avner. It's been nothing but kind to us. We're all done. I'm gonna show you right now. Oh wow, Av. Shout out to the boy Christian Vera. Very good dude. Yes, sir. Everything is out of here. Shout out to my boy Adriano. Shout out to Emma. Everyone who picked up some of my goodies, man. I'm so grateful that you guys have it. I wouldn't have it any other way. Shout out to all those let go buyers, I guess, but really truly shout out to the homies. Who ended up making this uh, such a special experience getting rid of all my Vegas stuff, man. Leave the stuff here, but you know, I take the memories with me and I'm just so happy. Yeah, moving ain't easy, especially when you're moving a cross country trip like us. Check this out. Yep. We got rid of almost everything that we own. We consolidated most things into bags here. Yep. Oh, man, we're on film right now. Hey, dude, hey, welcome to uh, Tori's Trails, y'all. God damn it! <laughs> I know, dude, we're all here, man. Holly came from Miami, FLA Hitchhiked away across USA Plucked her eyebrows on the way Shaved her legs and then he was a she She says, hey babe, take a walk on the wild side Said, hey honey, take a walk on the wild side She was everybody. All right, hold on. This is so exciting. I know. Always got the cartoons on in the hotel room to feel good vibes. Um, yeah, my throat's hurting. Not COVID related because I slept in front of a fan in like 69 degrees. That's what I like to do. So my throat hurts. My mom recommended these and they work really well. They're kind of expensive, so warning you. But if you ever feel a sore throat coming on or something like that, grab those and then we went to Harmon's you have to check this place out it's so I think it does it have the name on here no. um, they make delicious breads and like it's just a really cool grocery store we got a Salt Lake City hold on, let me focus it a Salt Lake City magnet and then we got some fruits some salads and then I just got these um, since I'm not feeling I feel fine but yeah I mean not as good as I should. Um, and then, yeah, some fruits in there and a salad and stuff so we don't have to go out to eat every day. And then we got some soups. Havner gets these things that are so bad for you. And then that's not good for you either, but I got that one. That beautiful Salt Lake City air. Oh, I freaking love this place. And a place to eat. Went to the Apollo, you should have seen him go, go, go. They said, hey, sugar, take a walk on the wild side. I said, hey, baby, So we're at this very random Jewish side. sculpture oh, garden. Right. And I'm not sure huh. what the meaning of anything is. I do. That's like a pharaoh over this there. It's all Old Testament stuff, and it's really, really awesome. To, uh, Jackie yeah, but what do the statues have to do with it? Appreciation. Thought you were just listening to that. <laughs> 
Then I guess she had to crash. Valium would have helped that crash the same way. Welcome to Midnight Deer. Huh? What the fuck is it? Hey, honey. Take a walk on the wild side, and the colored girls say, do 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 Here we are. We're in the beautiful Salt Lake City. You have my heart today, man. Wasatch. Wasatch. Correct me. Wasatch. Mountains in Big Cottonwood Canyon. We are at Donut Falls. <sighs> and now we're all alone. There's a moose over there. You probably cannot see him. He's right there and he's eating. I've never seen a moose, so bucket list check. Moose spotting first. So the moose is right there. I don't have my zoom in lens on and I'm not gonna change it. You can see it perfect. I kind of assumed there was something here because there's like a hundred people. I'm so sad this is as far as my camera goes right now, but he's right there. He's eating flowers. He is absolutely spectacular. It's my first moose ever. Yeah, I've never got to see a moose either. I'm just so happy. Look, you can see him moving, maybe. Oh, yeah, look at him. There he goes. Look at him. He's huge. All right, so we are hiking to Lake Mary. We are so far away from where we started. We're on the last bus to Wisdom. And we're so high up. The entire trail has been inclined. I think we're gonna do Dog Lake instead because it's a natural lake, so let's go up. sunset over here tonight. We're really tired from that horrible uphill hike. So, look at all these holes in the What's in here? 